Okay, let's see. What do we need to do? Wait, what is today? Oh, yeah, that's right, it's Saturday. Okay, I'll go get dressed and see what everyone else is doing. Yeah. Oh, all of this. Okay, uh, let's see. Oh, breakfast. Yeah, I should probably get that. Oh, uh, good morning, Mom. Good morning, Dad. Where's Mackenzie? Don't you remember? She went to her friend's house yesterday for a sleepover. She won't be back till Sunday. But she'll miss church. No, her friend is dropping her off at church. Oh. Oh, okay. And uh, so, what's going on, Mom? Oh, nothing. I'm just reading this book. It's really interesting. Cool. So, uh, Dad, can you make me some waffles? Sure thing, sweetheart. Uh, I'll be right back. Uh, okay. Okay, I'm back. And I have a little something for you, Allie. Oh, Mom, you didn't need to. You didn't have to get me anything. But you don't know what it's for. Oh, yeah, I guess you're right. Me and your dad knew that your birthday was coming up, and so we decided to get you a little something for your birthday. This isn't the present that you're getting for your birthday. It's just a little something. Wait, what? We got her a gift? Wait, what? What did we get her? Really, William? Wink, wink, you know? Remember? Oh, sorry, honey. Sorry. And now I know. Okay. So, uh, what is it? Well, you'll have to find out. Here. Can't see. I'm so excited. <gasps> oh my gosh. It's so pretty. I love it. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Try it on now. Come on. Okay. I love the necklace, it's so pretty. Okay, I gotta try this on now. Oh my gosh, I look so pretty. Thank you, mom and dad. Oh, you're welcome. <laughs> yeah, you're welcome. Well, I gotta go. Uh, I have a meeting. I'll see you guys later, okay? Okay, bye. Bye. Okay, see you later. Hey honey, so, what did you think of church today? Uh, you know, same as always. You know, just different messages and stuff. But, uh, yeah, I, I like it. Good, good. Oh hey, Dad, uh, I was wondering if I could invite Lucy over. Oh, uh, sure. Uh, when do you want her over? Can she come over now? Sure. Okay, cool. Smooth, real smooth, William. Did you say something, Dad? Oh, okay. So, um, how are you doing? Same as always. Great, I guess. I really like what you've done with the place. It's really cute. Yeah, thanks. So, how's your dad doing? To be honest, I don't know. He's started acting weird every time he comes home from work. Like, he's gone insane. I really don't know. That's weird. Has he started doing anything different? Uh, not that I know of. I know that he's been contacting someone a lot. I don't really know what exactly they talk about. It just sounds like they're up to no good, but I don't really know. If I got into his business, he would get really mad at me. And, well, that'd be the end of that. Hmm, huh, that's strange. Yeah, super. Oh, ah. Uh. Girls, uh -huh. how are you guys doing? You're doing great, Mom. Oh, uh, good. Um, Lucy, I just got off the phone with your dad. He's in the hospital right now. What? What do you mean? A neighbor found him on the front yard. 
he was passed out and they took him to the hospital. I don't know what's happening over there, but I think you should go over to your dad. Oh my gosh. That's terrible. You have to go to him. You're right. Oh, okay, well, I'll see you guys later, okay? Um, thanks for everything. Good luck, Lucy. Bye, Lucy. Do you think he'll be okay, Mom? I don't know, sweetheart. Who knows? Huh? Huh. Lucy. Wonder what she's doing up so late. Oh. Hello? Hey, Allie. What's going on? Oh. I guess your parents haven't told you yet. Told me what? Told you that my dad is dead. Wait, what? He died a few hours ago. Oh my gosh, Lucy, I'm so sorry about that. Uh, are you okay? Um, to be honest, not really. I mean, he was never like a father to me, so it's nothing really changed, but now I'm just alone and I have no one else to take care of me now. Lucy, I, I don't understand. Why aren't you like crying and stuff? I mean, not that you have to or need to. He was not really a father to me. He didn't really act fatherly. I don't know how to explain it, but he, when I was talking to you about his behavior, it just didn't feel different to me. So him gone now, it's just kind of lonely, I guess. And I'm not even old enough to live on my own. My mom's gone, he's gone, and I've no one else now. Oh, I see. I'm so sorry. If there's anything you need, just let me know. I'm sure I can get my parents to help you out. Yeah, thanks. You know what? Pack your stuff. Get ready to go. Wait, what? what? What are you talking about? Tomorrow I'll pick you up. You can stay at my house for as long as you need. And we can take care of your dad's house. But what about your parents? They'll understand, Lucy. Don't worry about it. Just pack your stuff, get some sleep, and be ready tomorrow, okay? Okay. Uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Yeah. Uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye. William, I told you, we're not doing it. It's too expensive and we can't afford it. Avery, come on, it's for her. We've never done anything for her. She deserves it. No, William, I keep telling you over and over again. We're not doing it. Avery, honey, no, don't. 